So I chose this course because when I was doing my foundation in uh, media at uh, Ravensbourne, I found that there wasn't really like a lot of um, space for me to be creative. There was a lot of like restrictions and limitations on what, what, you, what subject matters you would film, how you'd film them. And I came from a fine art background. So I was like, how can I do film and art? And then literally this course was like, That's, this is the course, it's a fine art film course. So yeah. I've really enjoyed the uh, freedom like to create in any medium, like multiple mediums and just like uh, focus on any kind of topics that you want to and be completely experimental about it. That's, that's what I've enjoyed most. The best thing about Brighton is um, the seaside, like, and just the entire like, vibe. And just, it's, it's very relaxed here. Um, yeah, I don't know, there's just, yeah. It's a, nice, it's a nice place to be creative, yeah. The staff on the course have actually been like, really um, helpful to me and supportive, actually. Um, and they've given me a lot of insight and I like have quite a lot of respect for them because they are still artists working in the real world, which on like many courses that I've seen or been a part of, that's not always the case. So it's nice to like have a genuine like respect for an artist who's still working and like offering advice and stuff like that. So my ambitions after uni, um, I would like to create an animated TV series. Um, so yeah, I'm just in the process of, of writing that. Um, and, and drawing up like the characters and stuff, and I'm just going to be pitching that over the next the next year or so. And then my plan is to do my masters as well after that in Portugal for a year. So that's what I'll be doing.